Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for the 27th, July 27th, 2019. This reading is not sign specific and it's not time specific, and I know I have a few singles readings left to do, and I will get them done hopefully tonight. Okay, so anyway, this is just a daily energy for somebody. It's a message from my guides. Basically, it's a preview of what's to come. We'll see what happens. Let's start right here. What do we have for the 27th? Wheel of Fortune, so destiny, we have change, this is faded change, something good is happening, so uh, one, one chapter is coming to an end, this is a completion, um, whatever is happening is bringing you closer to your life's purpose, something is destined, this is destined change, so something destined is about to happen, I mean that's what that is. Well, let's get one of these. This is considered a lucky break, okay? It's the Wheel of Fortune. So, you know, at the end of this, you know, this 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 change is very fortunate, okay? You could think of it and it's, you could think of it like serendipity. It's like a fortunate accident perhaps, but it doesn't have to be an accident, but you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? So, we have something fortunate that is happening. It's it's good, whatever it is. Destined to be. Well, I guess we'll go with that one, huh? How teachable are you? How teachable are you? We will read that one. Number nine. Nines are about closure, coming to the end. Um, are you open to learning new things in your life? How high is your desire to let go of judgment, doubt, negativity, and self-sabotage? What are some of your favorite things to do? Is it to watch TV, go shopping, play golf, drink, gossip with your friends? Are you willing to give those things up in order to create time to learn something new? Are you sick and tired of being sick and tired? What is your willingness to really apply what you learn? You might be learning many new things, but be resistant to change. Every time you begin to think, I already know this, I've heard it before, this doesn't apply to me, your ability to learn diminishes enormously. And it is at that, this point you may, be, you may become virtually unteachable without realizing it. Unless you apply what you have learned in your life, you won't really know it. This card is beckoning you not only to be open-minded, but to take specific action towards change. And this is a change, of course. Destined change. But we have so many people that are, that, that are unteachable, obviously. This doesn't apply to me. That's a big one, isn't it? How do you know? You don't until you try. There's something to be learned. There's something to be learned. Same thing. So we have a change that is coming or a change that is happening. This is something new, okay? It really is. But somebody's going to have to do something they never, ever done before. I won't be surprised if we get the Page of Pentacles. Um, you know, this is starting over and learning new things, not knowing, but doing it anyway. Six of Pentacles reversed. King of Wands reversed. 
The Fool. Starting fresh. Starting with a clean slate. But this is the King of Wands reversed. This is clinging to control. Not wanting to make any changes. Very, very set in their ways. So yeah, we have somebody here that is not receiving their full potential. They're not getting the pay that they want. Or they're not getting the abundance that they want. Or their things are unbalanced and uneven in their life. And it's because they... They're very controlled. They're very controlling. They're ve they, they live a certain way. Here, starting with a clean slate, letting go of the baggage, starting fresh. It's time to fly. There's nothing left to prove. It's just time to be happy. It's time to... This is... Thoughts are... I mean, thoughts. Swords are thoughts. They are ideas. We have somebody here that has been really, really struggling with their own mental conflict. If they could just come up with some new ideas, try some new things. Six of Swords, moving to a better place, moving on. This is the rite of passage, moving, getting to the other side. Leaving, leaving the unhappiness behind. There's definitely been some conflict. There's been some power struggles about trying to win, trying to prove, you know. But in reality, it's not about proving anything. It's about your own happiness. It's not, you don't have to prove anything to your neighbors or your anybody. Anyhow. High Priestess, this is you know. I know. Very intuitive. This is using your silence as a tool, harnessing your inner power, going within, keeping to yourself, following your own path, not reciprocating. Let's get the rest of the cards. I don't break into this. Oh, there's the Page of Pentacles. Well, we talked, we just, I kind of saw that one coming, I guess, I suppose. Yep, there it is. There it is. Starting new things. I mean, yeah. But we get this person that thinks they know it all. I mean, the high priest just thinks she knows it all. She does. She does. I know all. Trust me. Okay? It's reality here. This is a reality jet. It really is. So... We got somebody here that needs to try new things, needs to start fresh, start with a clean slate. But the 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 the, the feeling that I need to control is, is huge here. Therefore, they're not receiving what they truly deserve because they think they know. Un unwilling to budge. And this is unwilling to budge. Very stubborn. We got somebody here that is very stubbornly, you know, holding on to something that they knew. And it's time to move on. It's time to move. Somebody may need to actually move. Like, move. Like, get in your... Pack your shit up and move. Move away from the conflict. Move away from the power struggles. Move away from the fears. Take a risk. Have faith. Stop trying to cling to the control. Go with the flow. Stop thinking you know everything you know because obviously what the cards say it's time for a change it's, it's time for you to learn new things it's time for you to start over and do things that you have never done before learn some new skills you notice the look on this guy's face not very you know it's not easy it's scary but it can this is a big opportunity it's a big golden opportunity right This is a new enterprise. Somebody has an opportunity to make more money or find something more solid, more stable if they would only step into the unknown. Take this risk. Take a risk. It's like this one right here has an opportunity absolutely to be their own boss or to climb the ladder, but wanting everything to be your way or not seeing another person's point of view or not willing to learn new things or... This doesn't apply to me. I already know it all. You know, that's not going to get you what you truly deserve. People don't want to give to that. They don't. Right? They don't. This is starting without knowing. This is also an opportunity to manifest something huge. But you're going to have to let go of your ego. Let go of your pride. Let go of control. I hate to repeat myself. Oh, God. Yeah, it does. It takes strength. It takes a lot of strength. 
But holding on to security, holding on to what you already have is, is pretty damn comfortable, isn't it? It's comfortable. But that stubbornness that we were just talking about isn't going to bring you any in any more abundance. It's not. Resisting change. We got somebody here that is resisting change very, 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 very much. Let me just make sure this is zoomed in correctly. So somebody is not receiving harmony, balance, reciprocation. They're not getting they're either they're not getting paid enough or they're not they're not getting enough. It's like they're not there's not equal give and take here. But they don't have the self or well, not that's not right. They don't have the ability to step outside of their comfort zone. You know, they're very controlled, very, very structured, very, very organized. You know, you get, sometimes you, you have to face things that you've never seen before, even if it's fearful, and take the chance. It's like you got to take a chance. Um, it's time to, this is take a chance as well, take a risk. I think that we have somebody here that is going to be given an opportunity. You may even receive a message from somebody, okay? A message from somebody that offers you something. Um, and it, and it, may, it may be from somebody who you don't particularly have a lot of faith in. I feel as though that you, you're probably, somebody is going to receive an opportunity from somebody that, gives them the chance to do something that they never done before. This opportunity could allow this person to step into unknown territory and start over and get to a much better place. This is fortunate. Okay, it's fortune. It could bring fortune into your life. It could bring something very fortunate. But you're, but you're going to have to take a risk. You're going to have to have faith. Ace of Cups reversed. We got somebody here that is emotionally detached, perhaps. You know, there's, 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 there's a lack of... Um, emotional content there's an emotional blockage here it's like shutting down this opportunity this is emotional shutdown it's shutting down this opportunity to break free from somebody else's control okay because it's, it's like you have an opportunity to this is, this could be job related or could be relation i don't know what this is there's an opportunity to break free from somebody else's control but the only way to do that is to face your fears and and you know that this is going to be a new path. This is going to be a new horizon. It's going to be a new opportunity. Okay? This is the page of pentacles is when you find that moral backbone to do the right thing for you, even if it's scary. Okay? So, this is when you take charge and you decide that you are going to try something else. You're going to do it, even though you don't know how to do it. Okay? So, I feel like that we, somebody is going to receive an opportunity, you know to let go of something emotionally unfulfilling and start over someplace else. Go someplace else. Go someplace else. But there, this is a card of ego, and this is a card of ego, and they're mirroring each other. So somebody's going to have to face their ego. It doesn't matter what anybody else says. Fuck them. Okay? Just telling you. Because, I mean, if you're going to let somebody else control your fortune, then... <laughs> That's sad. Just saying. That's really sad. Anyhow, you choose. You choose. All right? You have to be open-minded. You have to be open to the possibilities. You have to be open to what the universe has for you that you have never, ever seen before. 
This is let go. This is finally letting go of regrets, letting go of your pride, letting go of your ego. You know, I just want to be happy. Somebody has been restricting themselves because of this two of wands reversed fear of the unknown. I mean, this is this reading is about fear of the unknown. This doesn't apply to you, does it? Because you don't have any fear whatsoever. Bullshit. So, fear of change, indecisiveness, restricted. Fear of the unknown right here. You have this opportunity. It's like this door is going to open. It's your choice. You're going to have to find your strength and your confidence and your courage to let go of your fear and face the unknown. This is an opportunity to move to a better place, to get to a place of peace and serenity and happiness. So I feel like somebody is going to receive an offer. They're going to probably, it may come in as a message, whatever, from somebody that, you know, says, hey, you know, I got this exciting opportunity for you, you know. This isn't, this isn't, but it, this is, this is kind of, you know, I don't have really a plan. You know, there's no real big plan, but we can, you know, fly by the seat of our pants. Take it. That's my advice. This could be in the regards to work or love. This is an opportunity to, to start fresh. But I have to tell you, you're going to have to be open to learning something new. This could bring you good fortune. It's meant to be. Don't, don't pass it up. Good luck.